we are gathered here together to celebrate the union of two of my favorite pups. Is this a fairy tale? It's a love that I'm feeling. Oh, pull it together, you two. It's a wedding, not a funeral. So come on, everybody. Get on up. And let's show these two just how groovy puppy love can be. Let there be joy throughout the land. Let's all come together, raise your paws and clap your hands today. Two hearts will beat as one. Let there be love. Let there be love. Oh, I do think it's in it back again. I'll pledge my love to you. I vow to love and cherish you. Of course I say I do. I do. Love will blossom, don't you know? Let your light shine, Let it shine. like stars above. Let's put in motion this devotion and let, let there be love. Let's raise the roof and how woo woo. Let love provide the answer and you'll have the proof. Hey, oh, be easy, fam. And then you'll see, you'll see your destiny, your destiny, side by side. Oh, you are grown and right, and look at the right, and be your guide. Let there be love, let there be love. Let there be love. Let there be love. What time is it? Uh, 2.50 still. They've been in there for hours. It's been five minutes. Look, these things take time, okay? Just breathe. Remember Lamaze class. <laughs> Good. I'm bugging out here. Ah! Oh, we tiny. I'm coming. <gasps> Just it, calm down, okay? Here, have a cigar. What? I don't smoke. Yeah, I don't either, actually. I don't get it. Why do we even have cigars? I don't know. I got the call that Tiny was having the puppies. I ran to the car, I fell, I hit my head. I was driving by a cigar shop and I bought a bunch of cigars. I have no idea what was going on, okay? I'm on autopilot right now. Would you just please calm down, P.U.P. Lou, 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 the puppies, are they? Can't talk, getting towels. Shep, I'm dying out here. What, uh, Tiny, is she even? I'm sterilizing. I don't have time for your melodrama. But wait, you're killing me here. Oh, that goes for you too, Papa. What? I uh, Tiny. Tiny's doing great, Mr. Steven. And the puppies are coming soon too. I'm already flipping my fur, dog. But we can't bring the puppies into this world to meet esta gente loca now, can we? No. Yes. I mean, no. We're not loca. We're we're fine. We're normal. We're not crazy. You're more cuckoo than that clock. Okay. Ay, rápido, mi gente. Towels. Uh, oh, huh? We have hot water. Hot Water! Ah! I need a nap. Time to wake up, Papa. Yeah. The puppies are here. What happened? <gasps> Wait. Wait. Three adorable girls, Rosie, Charlie, and the tiniest one, Cindy. And a very handsome boy, Brody. 
Aren't they the most beautiful puppies you've ever seen? Yes, they are, old pal. Oh, my dog! Tiny! Is she okay? Um, well, come see for yourselves. Come on! How you doing, darling? I can truly say that I've never, ever been better. We're going to be good parents, right? We're gonna be awesome. Those orphans have foiled Julio for the last time. <laughs> Say it. Say the line. Holy frijoles, mi amiba. Evil just got a lot better looking. Cut! Cut! Finally. Please tell Julio he can start acting any time now. Ay, ay, ay. Lo siento, everybody. The gringo is still adjusting. If I'm so bad, why am I here? Ratings, idiota. You're like a gargrash. You miserable little imp. I can't do this. Anymore! Get these amateurs off my set! This show won't last two episodes without me. Do you know who I am? James, an out-of-work gringo actor. Somebody get me casting? I need two dogs. One a medium, one a chihuahua. <gasps> there is only one Julio. How hard. Do you think it will be to find a chihuahua? This is a magical idiotas! Uh, wait, what? what just happened? Uh, uh, Julio is confused. Wait, wait, wait! I can play both parts. I'll work for scale. Come on, scaredy cat. Get in there and stamp it down. This is so gross. <laughs> Wait, Cano, something's moving in here. Better keep stamping! <laughs> Yo, turn the camera off! <laughs> oh, you think this is funny? <laughs> How's this for a headline? Hack reporter gets free ambulance ride. <laughs> You're watching DMZ. Way to take a hit. Glad it's you, not me, Mickey. Looks rough. Or the... You're a true journalist. Mean team, you're the ultimate losers. Trash taking out trash, am I right? Oh, wow. And how do you get fired from your own show? <laughs> Am I right, guys? Just when you thought you couldn't sink any lower than daytime TV. I guess crime doesn't pay. You said, what do you mean? Charlie, Rosie, Cindy. What's up, bro? You are not going to believe what's going on in the kitchen. Breathe, Brody, breathe. Come on, come on. Mm, turkey time. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Do you know, when I first came to America, I thought you were all loco with it at the Thanksgiving. But all now, oh, I love the pumpkin pie. Yes. Mm. Oh, Mr. Steven, you will spoil your dinner. Okay. Okay. Oh. Hot. Oh, no, 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 no. It says right here in my Julia Child's cookbook, you cannot start carving for 15 minutes. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Let's set the table. Yes, I love this Thanksgiving table. Bro, I think you just found the mother load. It smells so delicious. Forget how it smells, Rosie. I want to know how it tastes. Brody, we can't do that. What if it's poisoned? What are you even talking about, Brody? I know. What if I take a bite and test it first? If there's no poison, it's just a teensy bite, right? But if there is, I'm a hero. You know that doesn't make any sense, right? Puppy's first Thanksgiving. 
I can't believe it's already here. You know, it's kind of magical seeing a holiday through up pup's eyes. <laughs> when I was their age, I was on the streets, spitting rhymes and hustling full time. Oh man, my first bite of turkey, hallelujah. Brody, is it poisoned? Uh, I can't tell. I, uh, gotta keep checking. Uh, hey, he can't oh stop God. eating. He's got uh, golden retriever fever. I told you guys, this was a bad idea. Well, we can't let it go to waste. We gotta hide the evidence. Now, where's that pie? Guys, snap out of it. Whoa, 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 what's going on in here? <gasps> uh, happy Thanksgiving, loving family. <gasps> My pumpkin pie! It's good! <laughs> Come on! I know what this looks like, but great news. <laughs> the turkey isn't poisoned. It was all Brody's idea. <gasps> He's the mastermind. <gasps> Boss chucker, turkey hucker. Stop snitching. <laughs> Rule numero uno, never admit guilt. We plead the fifth. Grandpa Steve, you're our lawyer. What? Well, I'm the judge, they're the very hungry jury, and you're all doing time in your room. Ugh. Tough love, sis, I'm telling you, it works. It's not like them to act out like this. Maybe we're not spending enough time with them. That's a possibility. Well, we have been spending a lot of time at the studio, and the live shows, and the galas, and the... Oh, jeez. Oh, no. We're deadbeat parents. You can spend some quality time with them. And you could create your own family traditions. <gasps> Lou, you genius! <gasps> Pup star. A puppy star Christmas. Oh, chest pups roasting on an oak. We'll circle back to the title. <laughs> but, headline, ratings gold. Lou, you always have the best advice. A little family time will turn those pups right around. In that case, I think it's time we taught them about the Christmas spirit, family sharing, and not destroying my turkey. Or my pumpkin pie. Why are they so uptight? Either way, that turkey was going to get eaten. And Ida's pie? was delicious. Guys, you're missing the point here. Uh, you're right, sis. We didn't even get a taste Grandpa Steven's world-famous stuffing. That's not what I meant. Ida and Grandpa worked really hard getting dinner ready. Maybe we didn't consider the consequences. Nah, that can't be it. Quick, uh, look like we learned something. I think all is need to apologize to Grandpa. We're sorry, Ida and Grandpa Steven. I guess we just couldn't resist your amazing cooking. Oh, it's hard to argue with that, right? right? Yeah. <coughs> oh, okay. What Grandpa means to say is... Right. We all make mistakes. The important thing is that we recognize them and not repeat them. Roll back. I think I missed something here. Well, Pops, Christmas is just around the corner, and it's time you learn the true meaning of Christmas. Grandpa Steven's going to read you his favorite Christmas book. Santa and the Naughty Elf. Uh... Let's get these boys Today, my fellow helpers, I'm here to convey. It's time to work our magic, cause Santa's on his way. When we all pull together, Christmas dreams come true. Let's do this for Santa and Mrs. Santa to make this the best Christmas ever. With all the joy that we can bring, make this the best Christmas ever. Come on and make those jingle bells ring, 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 ring. Santa, 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 yeah! So great to have you with us. Christmas cheer. Let's make this joyful season last throughout the year. Remember Christmas spirit and what it's all about. So open up your hearts and let's help each other out. Make this the best Christmas
So bad. You wouldn't understand. You're used to living in trash. And now I'm used to living with trash. <laughs> You've been seen. <laughs> I crack myself up. Uh, if it wasn't for Tiny and that flea bag wrapper, I'd own Pop Star. Y ahora, una gran noticia. Allow me to introduce the Purina Zarina. The fashionista that is fur, the canine queen and everything in between. Just, just let them talk. Uh, okay, I mean... <sighs> Happy holidays, everybody! Is there no end to my humiliation? Pupstar and Dog Pound Records are proud to present the first ever Pupstar Christmas special. All our friends are gonna be there. Julio, translate. You still can't speak Spanish? Learn the language, Americano. Listen, I have minions to speak it for me. Minions like you. Okay, so he's saying, Tiny's putting on a pop star Christmas special in honor of a new familia. But props to our main man, Chef, for booking us the best guest star ever. We got Santa Claus. You got Santa? Santa. With special guest, Santa Claus? Uh, surely my invitation has simply been lost in the email. <laughs> well, well, well. Julio, what's bigger than Christmas? Nothing. It is the most sacred of holidays. Unless there was a Julio de Mayo, of course. Exactamente. <laughs> <laughs> Don't blame yourself, Charlie. Chess is a tough game. Minutes to learn, years to master. Hey, look! Ida has a charcuterie board. <gasps> Sweet cheeses and meat! <laughs> Charlie, what are you doing? That's cheating. Shh, go be a goody two-shoe somewhere else, Sydney. I'm fleecing this room. <laughs> mm. Checkmate. <gasps> Hang in there, Uncle Shep. Your luck will change. Best seven out of 13. Hey, ma'am, it's your loot. Five new headshots. Woo, yeah, that girl's got swagger. Four sizzle reels, three feature tracks, two Tony knots, and a movie lead that's written just for me. <laughs> Yay! Amazing. You're a natural. <laughs> yes, Rosie. <laughs> okay, okay, I know what you're thinking. Star power, it factor, glamour. 
Brody? Brody, what are you doing with Grandpa's lights? Oh my... oh. I think it was me. Cindy? What do you have there? I found it in a box with her Christmas decorations. That was my mom's favorite ornament. Thank you, Auntie Lou. You're the best auntie ever. Mm. <laughs> Coming through. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. Surprise! Oh. I love gingerbread. <laughs> How's that look? Did you steal my sandwich? Look, it's gone. Just buy a new sandwich. Oh, yeah, sure, Mr. Moneybags. On a garbage man's salary? <laughs> well, aren't you two a sorry sight? I told you to never show your mug here again. I'll wreck you like a squeaky toy. No, no. Ah, no, Cano. Yes, 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 Bark. Beat it. We've got paying jobs. Honest. Smelly. Lousy, paying jobs. Hola, Roland. Good to see you again, compadre. My money's on Cano. I'd put three to one on Bark. He is very tricky, no? Cano! I've got a new plan, and it's foolproof. Oh! Score! <sighs> you say that every time. And guess what? Every time, it doesn't work. Just hear me out. Want to try? Cano, what's bigger than Popstar? Oh, I know, I know. Mr. Rogers. Ugh, idiot. Christmas! People have to buy presents, no matter what. No, not in Mexico. Santa brings gifts for the poor niños and pops. Only if they've been good all year, of course. Not anymore, he doesn't. We are gonna run the North Pole. You wanna take over Christmas? That's quite the score. Enough loot for every kid on Earth. All right, I'm in. Me too. On one condition, I get to fly the reindeer. Yes, you can fly the reindeer. Yes! 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 <sighs> Finally! Muy bien! Everyone's in. Los cuatro amigos! <laughs> now, may we please go somewhere warm? Because Julio is not built for the cold. Do you want to tell him? He'll figure it out soon enough. How do we get to the North Pole? Thank you. Okay, we'll need some disguises. Somebody leave a giant bag of candy canes back here? Let me get some. Let's get some. Where's the candy cane? How you doing? Hey, that belongs to me. And that's where a sugar addiction will get you. It's sad, really. <sighs> Oh. Huh. 
All aboard to Santa's workshop. Oh, Mama, that's good. Sip it. We've got a ride to catch. Sorry, gang. We gotta take the next coach. Only one seat left. I got this. Get out! Oh, look! Two seats just opened up. <laughs> what luck? Is he okay? Julio's a cold? Oh, yeah. He's just not used to the cold. Right? Freezing. This whole thing. <laughs> I'm standing in for Santa, kind of like an understudy. Oh, Mr. Oh, Stephen, how do I That's right, that's right. Come on, come on, people, let's go. Watch yourself, sir. <laughs> Nutcrackers. Finally, a venue big enough to showcase my talents and your ever expanding head. Hey, there's my pups. You guys ready to run your big entrance? Was that a serious question? I was. Born ready. Great. We're running the top and the tail, so watch for your cue. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh. Welcome to the North Pole. Quota on Mega Blocks, Whirly Tubes, Stud, Stud, Yo Yo's, Yo Yo's, Moon Shoes, and Whipple Bats, and for some unknown reason, Candy Cane Pattern Fidget Spinners. Todd, this is serious business. Get back to work. Jackpot. This will be easier than taking biscuits from a puppy. <laughs> Something funny? You guys act like you've never been to the North Pole before. Oh, yeah, it's uh, been a while. Been on sabbatical. I see we're still using ribbons. That's nice. Uh, yeah, well, we're South Pole elves. This is goofy, sleepy. Grumpy, and I'm bashful. Those are dwarf names. Elf names start with E. I'm Eli. This is Eddie. He's Elon. Get the picture? Well, nosy with a capital E. We're the big man's new undercover security team. But you don't want to get on our naughty list, do you? Oh! Julio, are you okay? Nice. Wrapping paper doesn't grow on trees. <laughs> uh, tell me, my good elves, where might we find Santa? My guess, since it's the middle of the workday, he's taking a Yuletide nap in his cottage. Thank you. All right, Tiny, here we are at the North Pole doing our first Christmas special. I'm so excited. Christmas is my favorite time of the year. Oh, no, no, Gnarly, please. Let me pull the sleigh all by myself. Try pulling in a straight line, man. You've been hitting the cat lip again. Go visit a barber. I'm as straight as an arrow. Cut, cut. Take five, everybody. Hey, Simon, where's that Christmas spirit, dog? And suddenly, the antlers aren't enough anymore. I shall be celebrating Christmas in my trailer. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. Okay, 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 okay. I got this. I have a plan. The perfect plan. Actually, I can't wait to hear this. I can have a plan, Cano. <laughs> oh, do tell. <laughs> 
I'll surprise him by going down the chimney Santa style. You'll never see it coming. <laughs> How original. Thank you. And I bet I could just fly up there. Check it out. <laughs> Here you go. Is it weird? I want him to succeed and fall down the chimney into the fire. Well, great. He's going to brag about this forever. That's right. That's right. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. Whoa. Dumb as forever. <laughs> How about we try the front door? That's a good plan. <laughs> what is the meaning of this? Sorry, big guy, but there's a new Santa in town. Me. You've been downsized. <laughs> 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 Remember, pups, you're up right after me. We won't let you down, Mr. Shap. Obviously. Saving the best for last, per usual. I wonder what sweet swag Santa's bringing us this year. I don't know. It's a big surprise. But where is Santa? <gasps> That's my cue. Wait, is that my cue? I no say I'm busy. Yo, Santa, where you at? Oh. Dramatic entrance. I sure hope Santa shows up sometime soon. Today, maybe. Here's Santa. Five, six, seven, eight. Moving down stage and you sing, you dance. It's awesome. Party great, booty quick, booty quick. Dance, whip, dance, and jazz hands. Glad you could join us, SC. Oh, uh, ho, ho, ho. It took a little while, Tiny, but I think I found you the perfect present. Wait, Santa, do you mean? Are you for reals, Santa? You guys are getting the best Christmas present of all time. Well, uh, definitely a big surprise. <laughs> Ugh. How can one show have so many words and zero ninjas? These costumes are embarrassing. Not even designer knockoffs. I mean, come on, people. No elf princesses? <clears throat> uh, say hello to your Christmas surprise. Cut, reset, 10th time's the charm. <laughs> uh. Someone told me a fib. This is not Miami. I am certain of that now. No, really. We must have made a wrong turn. So sorry, short stack. <sighs> nice duds, huh? Now I can give myself that electric train you never brought me. Am I growing a beard? It takes more than a belly full of cookies to wear that suit. You can't be in the naughty list for starters. Oh, well then let's rewrite history a little, shall we? Hmm. Ah, here we are. <laughs> Stupid Christmas. All right, what's the scam this time? Ha-ha, <laughs> the scam, <clears throat> or the plan, as I like to call it, is that we are, we're, uh... What exactly is the plan again? I'm appealing to the most powerful emotion of human and dog kind. Love and kindness. Greed. Simple commerce, really. Oh. 
you're sadly underestimating the goodness of the human heart. Am I? Everyone wants their kids and pups to wake up to toys or gifts or cookies or whatever on Christmas morning. Well, now they're going to buy it from the greatest brand of all time, Santa Claus. Then we go to Miami and thaw out on the beach with chiquitas. Christmas spirit doesn't come in packages, Bark. You can't sell people good times with the people they love. Mm -hmm. Any of this ringing a bell? Hmm. No. Surely you have people you love, don't you? Oh, get with the times, old man. Humans and dogs are insatiable. They'll buy anything. If they don't, we put coal in their stockings. The ultimate punishment. <laughs> <laughs> That's no bueno. Get up! We got mail! Did Santa write us back about our list of demands? Ugh, nothing but catalogs and bills. Maybe we didn't make the nice list. <laughs> no way. I mean, sure, we've got a few minor infractions, but we've served our time. Right? Right? I got it. Santa's the surprise guest star of the show, right? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Say what? Dad said I was the guest star. Keep going, sis. The diva needs some time to process the obvious. We sneak into Santa's sleigh, fly to the North Pole, and demand the loot we deserve. In and out, back in time for Christmas, easy peasy. All in favor, say aye. 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 Nay. That's unanimous. I'm pretty sure that's not what unanimous means. All right, E-Bob, I need you to go around and collect all these fidget spinners. Uh... What's going on here? Is that Mary Girl? Poor Santa and Mrs. Claus have come down with a very bad flu. Oh, I better check on them right away. I'm afraid that's not possible. He's under quarantine. It's very contagious, especially to elves. That's why we're here, to pick up the slack. Yeah. Y yes, and he wants to make sure the elves are able to fulfill their orders for Navidad. Orders? You mean wishes? Orders, wishes, whatever. Listen, Roland will be filling in for Santa in the meantime. Yes, and I will need full access to Santa's lists, cookie supply, and of course, the reindeer and sleigh. This is highly unusual. Why is the room spinning? As you can see, this is an official order from the big man himself. Mm -hmm. I ordered Santa Claus a Christmas party. Bar can officially do it. Go ahead. Take a real close look. Uh, looks legit. <laughs> okay, uh, everyone, uh, this is the boss. Uh -huh. Ho, 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 everyone. Prepare the sleigh. I have very important events to attend to tonight. So. Chop, chop. <laughs> Amy Lou, can I ask you something? You could talk to me about anything. That's what aunties are for. Let's just pretend I have this friend that desperately wants to go for a joyride in Santa's sleigh. And you're worried that this friend might get you on the naughty list? Maybe. Okay, girls, you can chit-chat later. It's time to go. Okay. Look at our little pros. We're not rushing them into this, right? Nah, they know they can talk to us about anything. We're cool parents. <sighs> Look alive, Pops. This is the real deal. I need to know that I can trust you to behave yourselves tonight. Uncle Shep, we would never do anything to make your job harder. Besides, it's my debut. You say bark, we say how loud. Thanks for being such a stellar dog father. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Don't you patronize me with your heighty tighty to slime. Oh, no, no. Ooh. By the smell of you, I'd say they put the antlers on the wrong end. Dead it! You're a prima donna man. May I challenge you to a joss? Your blubber mop? I am so gonna mop you up, just like the mop head you Whoa. are. Whoa. Whoa, okay? Show me your moves, your ragamuffin. Be forewarned. 
I was varsity fencing at Dartmouth. Shut on, Okay, sit, stay, don't move a muscle. Ship to the rescue! Okay, eyes off target. You know the plan. Santa's sweet ride will be on the roof waiting for us. <laughs> Time to ditch the ship, dog. No, I object. Whoa, harsh, Cindy. All in favor of ignoring Cindy? Aye. Aye. Sorry, Cindy. Majority rules. <laughs> Somebody please tell me they have eyes on the pups. Nobody? Yeah, Johnny, Rosie, Brody, Cindy! Where did you get that suit? Turns out the little guys are great with a needle and thread. Who would have thunk it? You like it? Yeah. All right, time to get down to business. <clears throat> Elon, this sleigh is filthy. Please clean it. <clears throat> Thank you. Prancer, light on those hooves. I'm Prancer and he's dancing. Oh, right. I knew that. Uh, what's the difference again? Very smooth. Yeah, I don't do that. New Santa is quite the hipster. Timba! Looking foxy, Vixen. Are you... Are you playing reindeer games with me, Cupid? No, I just have resting loving eyes. Oh, yeah. Cupid. That makes sense. Could someone bring Santa a strudel? You look too skinny. Nice pecs, Blitzen. I take it you've been doing most of the heavy lifting around here? Dunka, I work out. And I take it you're the pilot, Flyboy? <laughs> it's Comet, Santa. That is enough insubordination out of you, fella. I am Santa, and what I say goes. You know, I have a friend who knows this reindeer named Rudy, and he would be happy to take your job. So, think about that. What a jabroni. What was that? I couldn't quite hear you, son. I, I said I like pepperoni, sir. So do I. So do I. Thank you. OK, just hold the reins loosely, and the reindeer will do the rest. I think I can handle it. I flew a helicopter once. Sort of. Till Christmas. <gasps> oh no, you didn't just slap my hiney. Giddy up. <laughs> <laughs> See, I'm a natural. What do you want, a trophy? Hope you are not a nervous fly. Whoa. Let's give him a shove. <laughs> Merry Christmas, boys and girls, pups and puppets, and welcome to the Pup Star Christmas Special! Oh, I love Christmas specials. I used to watch them with me familia when I was being chico. We remember, you were on the nice list back then. So kind and caring. Things change. <gasps> Shh, he's starting. All right, Tiny. Here we are at the North Pole doing our first Christmas special. I'm so excited. Christmas is my favorite time of the year. Here we go, guys. Coming in for a landing. Flying, Ace. You're a natural. <laughs> Put everyone ducks for cover. He's going to spill his cookies. 
<laughs> Spin counterclockwise. It always helps me. <laughs> you know, venison is a delicacy where I come from. Thanks for the ride, fellas. We'll be right back. You guys just sit here and uh, spin. Well, he's got to be around here somewhere. Please keep looking. Oh, it's Mr. Claus. It is such an honor to have you on our show. All right already. No need to slobber. Well, let's get the show on the road. Santa's a very busy man this time of year, as I'm sure you understand. Yes, yes, of course. Right this way. You, ah, get lost. <laughs> I've got some last minute changes for Santa's number. Five more minutes. Step, step, turn, step, jazz. This better be worth it. This is my deep you were missing. Remember, relax, sis. With all the loot we're gonna get, you can buy your way into showbiz. Sick, then you are great, great like a fox. So many deals for the record, this is a bad, I mean, worst idea ever. Get wise, Cindy. I'm only here to meet Santa. Get so tight. Man, look at us. Meeting Santa for some carols? I hope he's got a solid track lock and loaded. Trust me, this one's a showstopper. <laughs> ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas, everybody, from the Great North Pole. There's a new Santa coming to town. Now here's the situation, I'm now the Santa Corporation. So pay attention while I run this down. Rule one. For all you kids, no more naughty or nice. Go on, lie, cheat, steal, do whatever you like. And all you parents from now on, only money will suffice. But you can purchase Christmas spirit at a reasonable price. Jeez, why do we even bother our Is Santa having a midlife crisis? If you're naughty or nice. Santa's got a brand new plan. But if you don't have any money, I'm afraid it's no dicks. Now when I was young and foolish, I believed in being good. To be on Santa's nice list was my goal. But when Santa and his sleigh would arrive each Christmas day, he never left me anything but coal. Santa, has got a brand new jam. I don't care if you're naughty or nice. Santa. Here. Santa's going crazy. Oh no, our puppies! Here, I got it. <coughs> They're not in there. Oh no, this can't be happening. Where could our pups be? This way. Wait, this? is a bit of a surprise, no? Yes, a shocking and appalling surprise. <laughs> uh, <wee>. <laughs> You're <laughs> on fire. I know, the audience loved me, they really love me. Nope, you're literally on fire. Huh? <laughs> 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 Move it, Bozo. We don't want to be here when the canine cops show up. <clears throat> Ow! Push! We have lift up, pups. I'm sorry, Tiny. Did you find them? 
They've disappeared. They're not in costumes, they're not in the green room, they're not anywhere. Nothing? Yo, no stone unturned. Don't worry, I promise we will find them. They're horrible parents. I'll, I'll never forgive myself. Whoa, Aurora Borealis. It's just as beautiful as I imagined. Whoa. Hey, dirt. So long, old Christmas. This is the season for giving to us. <laughs> I can finally buy that luxury eye patch. Real velour. Oh, yeah. Everybody be cool. Try to blend it. I thought the North Pole was the happiest place on Earth. Uh, no, that's Disneyland. Don't be so judgy, sis. Elves are busy with tons of toys tonight. Now let's just go get our share. Listen up. Attention all you slackers. Let's pick up the pace. If you don't meet our quota, you'll soon be replaced. Let's no more you tied naps and candy breaks. No, 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 Minions, I hereby decree. Listen up. This holiday is now about what's in it for me. Uh, so hurry up, my little friends, or you'll miss all the fun. Pack up every parcel hurry. and ship them when you're done. This is the worst Christmas ever. Worst Christmas ever. Christmas ever. With all the cash that it will bring. This is the worst Christmas ever. Worst Christmas ever. I love the sound of money when. No quick, mistakes, quick, quick. no faking it, or else you'll old. be fine. That's right. Cause I'm rebranding Christmas, and it's a dollar sign. All now right. the Santa's corporate profits continue to grow. No, no. My favorite part of Christmas that? is that I'm rolling in dough. This is the worst Christmas ever. Worst Christmas ever. This truly is the nightmare before Christmas. Please help us find our puppies. Christmas won't be Christmas without our whole family together. Rosie <laughs> loves singing and dancing, and Charlie's as smart as a whip. Rosie's a straight up rascal, loves an adventure. And Cindy is kind and caring and soulful. <laughs> Christmas was, I mean, is her perfect holiday. We don't know if they're lost, or this is a prank or whatever. We just want them home for Christmas. We're offering a reward for their safe return. No questions asked. What kind of monster would do this? <laughs> Sorry. Ho, ho, ho. If you want toys, 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 go online and click, click, click santaclaus.pull. And remember, if your parents don't buy from Santa, they don't love you. I think I know where the pups are. What? Gentlemen, we're now the most profitable business in history. From now on, we charge for shipping. Whoa, hold the phone. Santa's charging us now? This is outrageous. I mean, What's even the point of being a good pup all year? Huh. Who stole your puppy? Don't you think I should have Santa's chair? I mean, I am the new Santa Claus. Oh yeah, you're not Santa. Think of yourself as the Ronald McDonald of the North Pole. What, you mean like a mascot? And the last horse crosses the finish line. Okay, you stay here. Cano and I are going to check in on our guests. <laughs> uh, 
All right, look alive, elves. Time is money. Candy doesn't grow on trees. Or does it? Eli, look into that. Here's our chance. Santa's alone. We go in, state our case for more loot and fame. Then I drive the sleigh home as agreed. Come on. Something isn't right. Santa isn't this mean and selfish in the book. Mm. Seriously, sis, you can't believe everything you read. Think of it like a movie, based on a true story but with embellishments to make it more interesting. Like Santa not being crazy and sweaty, and the total sugar junkie. All in favor, say aye. 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 Nay. Nope. Nada. Democracy. It just works. Mr. Claus, sir. We're here to negotiate the terms of our Christmas demands. How'd you guys get in here? We stole away in your sleigh. Sweet ride, by the way. Totally cherry. And the stole away thing shouldn't count against us since you stole my limelight at the show. Let me apologize in advance for my brother and sisters. They're a little confused about the true meaning of Christmas, but they have good hearts, honest. Uh, Santa's having a little bit of a senior moment, kids. Uh, who exactly are you? I'm Brody, you can call me bro. I'm Charlie, Rosie, obviously. And I'm Cindy, Mr. Santa, sir. Not to name drop, but our mom is tiny and our pop is P.U.P. Ding dong, ring a bell, kind of a big deal. Oh, well, I'm sure we can work something out. Woohoo, yeah! <laughs> Did I miss the punchline? Ho, ho, ho. Cindy was trying to tell us that the puppies were up to something big. And how is being on the roof going to help us find the puppies? Don't you see? Santa, he landed his sleigh here right before the puppies disappeared. Lou, you're a genius! Everybody, scour the roof for clues! Oh. Tastes like toothpaste. I think that's Snowball Reindeer Poop! It looks like Cindy left us a clue. The puppies are in the North Pole. Vámonos, mi gente, rápido, rápido. Let's go. Let's go. Vete, Tony, for humble lolio. Of course. The king of Broadway, you say. Sí, por supuesto. At this rate, there won't be enough Christmas spirit to power a piece of tinsel. We have to do something. Honey, we're home. Wake up, short stack. Huh? Uh, what was that? You're supposed to be standing guard. Uh, uh, <coughs> I, I mean, I, I was, Kano. It was a tricky trick I played to see if they tried to escape. <laughs> Never going to happen on Julio's watch. Not that you ask, but we're on track for the most profitable Christmas yet. I've got that workshop humming. What you're doing, Bart, is destroying the spirit of Christmas. Oh, look at the Christmas naughty list. It's out of control. The only ledger I care about is my accounts ledger, and it's also growing. Profits are skyrocketing. Ka-ching, ka-ching. Hey. <laughs> Look what I found. I told you, no mascots in Santa's cottage. Executive staff only. Excuse me? Who are you calling a mascot? Oh, OK. Well, I guess I'll just send Tiny and P.U.P.'s adorable little pups back home. What the? You did? But how did? Roland? Anyone else find an odd there's two Santas? Ho, 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 ho! Oh, it's Tickets, please. Tickets, please. Why is everyone staring at us? You Maybe. It's because you're dressed up as Mrs. Boss. Elvin? Incognito. Tickets, please. 
I want to look good for Santa. And this was the only costume in the wardrobe that fit me. Happy Ben. Shh, he's coming. Act normal. Hello? Tickets, please. It was just here. Um, I must have left it in my other pointy hat. Do you know who I think I am? Oh. Mrs. Kloss? Latina sister? <laughs> I will make sure there's a little extra something for you in your stocking this year. Being an elf is a calling. We work for the love of Christmas, not for money. And I'm pretty sure Mrs. Claus doesn't have a Latina sister. <laughs> of course I her sister. Trust me, I think I know. You can put our tickets on the North Pole account. Okay, you can go now. Bye-bye. Tickets, please. Tickets. Y feliz Navidad. Mrs. Claus, did that little turkey infraction put us on the naughty list? <laughs> no, dear. You're good puppies that occasionally make mistakes. It's part of growing up. Good, because we have some serious demands. I mean, requests. Assuming we escape, of course. I'm so glad you're the real Santa Santa. I was starting to lose faith. <laughs> thanks for riding. Keep it moving. Keep it moving. Come on. Thanks for riding. Have a good one. Thank you for riding. Senorita Claus? Ooh. <laughs> uh, excuse me, where's the bus to the North Pole? The coach is where it always is and has been forever and a day. Right this way. This way. That okay. way. Thank you. Have a good one. Adios, Miss Claus. Good to see you. And that's everyone. We're the only ones left. So let me get this straight. You filed an NPR missing persons report for four of your lost puppies. That's right, officer. And now your daughter, your show manager, and the puppy's nanny have suddenly gone missing. Officer, it's kind of an emergency. I'll get right on that. Oh, it's the glaze. Um, thank you for your time, officer. There has to be a logical explanation. If I know Lou, she's already hot on their trail. I hope. Well, thank goodness Ida is with them, wherever that is. Yeah, Tiny, nobody messes with Ida. Uh, finally. Go figure. This has your stench all over it. I should have known. Who else is crazy enough to ruin Christmas? Look at it as a reboot. Christmas 2.0. But I didn't call to bicker about that. I've already won. I'm calling because I have your pups. I knew you took them. Learn a new trick already, you dirty dog napper. Au contraire. That's the beauty of it. Seems some extra furry baggage snuck into Santa's sleigh. You're lying. Our pups would never... Am I? Your pups came here because they wanted more, more, more. Smart pups. Except little Cindy, who can't tell the difference between fairy tales and reality. Just when I thought you couldn't sink any lower. Skip the pleasantries. Name your price already. Oh, you'll love this. I want you to put on your Christmas special again. On Christmas Eve. Why? So you can ruin it again? So, you can thank your new official sponsor, me. Kenna will send you your new script. Do my show right and your little trespassers will be returned safely. Don't, and well, c'est la vie. So, deal? 
Of course it is. I have your puppies. Happy Christmas! I don't think we have any other choice here. We have to do the show. Here we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Welcome to the North Pole. This is where I'm going to sneak this trip lightly this way. supposed to be? Miss Claus, long lost Latina twin sister, Senora Claus. <laughs> it's true. Mm -hmm. Well, since we're being honest with each other, let me tell you a secret. Oh, love secrets, yeah? Ah! Oh. Plastic. Okay, fess up. Look, we're just trying to find our puppies. We think that Roland dog napped them. Yes, and take down that evil maniacal dog bark. What's your plan? Uh, we actually have no plan. Yeah, we didn't actually think we'd get this far, so we're kind of winging it. <laughs> okay. You want your pups back. Uh -huh. I want my workshop back. Uh huh. So let's go and get Santa. <gasps> okay. Yes. Okay. <laughs> we're gonna go get Santa. Hey! It's this way. Oh. <laughs> Santa. <laughs> I think it was the 1970s, right here. Oh, no manches! You're stress eating, gordo! If you don't like the way I eat, you don't have to watch, amigo. You know sugar's more addictive than caffeine. But you need discipline. I'm Santa. It's normal. Hey, so do you guys know if we're still getting gifts or. Answer. Sometimes even good kids don't get what they want. Happy? <laughs> ah, we have bigger problems, hombre. Enough. Enough already. Enough with the list of demands, and the scams, and the endless need for attention. Whoa, sis. Let's not get crazy here. Some of us were born to be the star. And let's not throw out all the fun, OK? Just because you're smarter, bigger, and more talented doesn't make you right. Brody, it's time you took responsibility for all the chaos you've caused in the name of fun. I feel like the stupidest, funnest brother ever. Brody, news flash, it's not always about you. Cut to Rosie, feeling like a terrible sister. Charlie, things all make you happy, period. I love you guys, even more than all my stuff. Oh, you want some crackers with that cheese? Get real, pups. Look here. You're right. There it is. You know, Roland, when you were a little boy, you were on our nice list. In fact, our records show you got that train you so kindly asked for. No, I didn't. You put coal in my stocking every year. Roland, come take a look at our records. train set that you always wanted. No, that's not true. I'm giving 
up on Christmas. that happened to you, Mr. Roland. I don't care. It was a long time ago. You don't want all those good little boys and girls to get coal in their stockings just because their families can't afford gifts, do you? No, no, no. Don't listen, Roland. He lies. Sweet, sweet lies. Julio. You were the happiest pup in the junkyard before you lost your family. You stopped believing in Christmas that day. Nobody tells Julio how Julio feels. Oh no, the waterworks. <laughs> Our sweet, sweet truths. We have a captive clientele, elves that work for candy, and zero competition. It's time to raise prices. Genius. All we have to do now is deliver on Christmas and charge those parents' credit cards into the ground. We're rich. Tiny's ruined. This must be what happy feels like. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, here's the plan. Shep, you're gonna bust down the front door. I'm not exactly the rough and tumble type. <gasps> I got this. Oh, oh, oh. Impressive. <laughs> Hey, come here. I got it. I, oh, I got it. All right. Elon, you're going to come down the chimney. I've always wanted to do that. Good. Lou, you keep a watch okay. out. All right, now, here's the thing. I'm going to go around back. As soon as you hear the moose mating call, uh, we go in. You'll know it when you hear it. Mm -hmm. OK, go. Here we go. Here we go. Why we go as sneak as sneak, you OK? Boss. Bark and Kano only care about themselves. Their souls are as black as coal. Yes, but you both have love in your hearts, which went dormant when you were hurt as little boys. <laughs> this, this is why you're Santa Claus. Now we can get Christmas back on track. <sighs> What was that? Christmas chupacabra? It's not moose mating season. <laughs> Elf uprising! Everybody flee! Hey, quit it! Eli, what's going on here? We're here to save you, boss! Oh. Props to you, SC. It's harder than it looks. <laughs> Good news, Eli. We're already saved. These nice pups and hit some chihuahua. Gracias. And formerly misguided man-child. <laughs> They've seen the error in their ways. <laughs> They're coming. Why am I not surprised? Just once, I'd like things to go smoothly. They're going, they're going. A gift? For me? <laughs> I mean, obviously I deserve it, but what do you get for the dog who owns the world? Uh-oh. <laughs> what the? Um, who are you? I'm the puppy's nanny, 
And I'm their manager slash publicist slash dog father. And I'm their Auntie Lou. I knew you'd come, Aunt Lou. That's what aunties are for. Do something, you halfwits! Sticks and stones may break my bones, but your names bounce off of Julio. We hereby officially resign from the mean team. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Roland, don't do this. Think about the good times, like, uh... Hmm. Bark, you are a perro muy malo. Time we take back the North Pole and show the world the true meaning of Christmas. <laughs> Later, dog breath. Say, you guys wouldn't mind us rerouting all your swag to good kids and puppies in need, would you? Take a picture of them, Elon. You'll be insta-losers. You won't be able to buy a follower. <laughs> If I were you, I'd stay in that jail. There's a lot of angry elves out there with low blood sugar. Foolproof, you said. So who is the fool? I just put the suit on and I'm sweating like crazy. Are you sure this is necessary? I mean, I'm more of a behind the scenes kind of guy, you know? Are we really doing this, T? Yes, and in spite of Bark, we are going to put on the best Christmas show ever. People need their spirits lifted, and we need to show Bark that he can't put a price tag on Christmas spirit. Let's do this. Ladies and gents, pups and puppets, on this Christmas Eve, the Santa Claus Corporation is proud to bring you the Pup Star Christmas Special. Tiny? P-U-P, and we hope their puppies will bring Christmas cheer to one and all at no extra cost. Uh, without further shameful promotion, this is a Pup Star Christmas! Together by the fire's glow Blushing by the mistletoe Laughing while we trim the tree that's what Christmas means to me Sharing what we have with friends Wishing that the night would never end Singing songs with family That's what Christmas means That's what Christmas means to me It's not about the gifts and shopping It's not It's the memories we share The love that fills the air That make the special season burn so bright Seven stories old and old The puppy snuggling next to you The gift of love is what I see That's what Christmas means. That's what Christmas, Christmas means to me. Farewell, my love. I'll be back in a North Pole minute. <laughs> I'm sorry there's no room for you four in the sleigh. Oh, don't sweat it, Santa. We'll hold down the North Pole till you get back. <laughs> <laughs> and now it's time to fly good tidings to all the good little pups and kids all over the world. Let's spread some Christmas cheer. But Brody, I sure could use a co-pilot to help me fly this sleigh. It's all happening. My vision board came true. I will not let you down, Santa. We'll be tracking your progress, sir. It's good to have you back. Glad to be flying with the good guys again, SC. Let's get a move on now. I'm ready to move and groove. We've got a Christmas to save. On Dancer, on Prancer, on Cupid, on Vixen, on Comet, on Blitzen! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> oh,
I gotta say, this Christmas kinda went off the rails. I just really hope Santa brought our wish. Am I, is this, can somebody please tell me what my cue is? Actually, I think that's my cue. Santa. <laughs> Dad! Lou! Oh. Merry Christmas. I'm so sorry that we're late. It's not Christmas unless we have the whole family together. I love you. I love you too. Look! Oh. Ho ho ho! Merry Christmas! There's a magic part of Christmas that never has to end. Love's the perfect gift to share with family and friends. Find forgiveness in your heart, and soon your heart will mend. Make Christmas part of every day. It's what I recommend. Christmas Eve is a little early to open presents, but I think we can make an exception. It would be an honor, Santa. Mom, Mom Dad! Dad. Oh, it's a Christmas miracle! Santa, you found our pups! <laughs> You're welcome, world! I found Santa! Rosie? Okay, okay. We found Santa. It was so crazy, I drove the sleigh, and Santa said I could come back every year. Oh, you'll have to excuse me, friends, but I'm a wee bit behind schedule this year. So, a Merry Christmas to all, and to all, a good night. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Santa. Merry Christmas! <laughs> just like this at the North Pole, and the elves run it. That's a true story. You're right. Oh, yeah. Goal! And Julio sees the World Cup for Mexico! The Broncos Wild! You know what else? What? I was Santa for a while. And all the elves agreed that Eli was no longer the naughtiest elf, but the warmest and the most giving and the most Christmas-spirited elf since Saint Nick himself. Eat it again, again! Oh! <laughs> We're good parents. For the moment, anyway.
Let's all come together, raise your paws and clap your hands today. Two hearts will beat as one. Let there be love. Let there be love. Oh, I do think it's in it back again. I pledge my love to you. I vow to love and cherish you. Of course I say I do. I do. Let's plan the sea and watch it grow. Love will blossom, don't you know? Let your light shine, Let it shine. like stars above. Let's put in motion this devotion and let that be love. Let's raise the roof and how we woo. Let love revive the answer and you'll have the proof. And then you'll see your destiny side by side. If you feel the need. Be 